Okay, we are going to do the uh, insecure direct object reference. Uh, we did some of it already. Get your web boot server up first. <coughs> All right. Then of course, as usual, you need to go to the web boot attack page and then do a login. So I've already done my login here. But uh, for this particular session inside the insecure direct object reference or idol remember that you need to do another login on the second tab right. the ID and passwords uh, given to you right, is over here so I'll just use this tomcat password All right. All right. we have already covered the three and four lab session and uh, on the lab tree we already identify the uh, user ID and for the <coughs> we identify the user ID as well as the path All right. so we can already view the path itself so on this tab 5 the top part is to view another profile Right, this part here which is actually to view another profile itself now we already have the path so let me just copy my path to another tab right. um, I need to modify this definitely to the path that I've uncovered previously uh, I will keep my local host 8080 uh, because I'm using it on the machine. Uh, you still need the web boot itself. But here, I only need to set the path to the IDO. There's no dot here. Profile. Then. Now, if you get a lot of these uh, messages, like your white label message, this is actually quite normal. What it's trying to say is that it is not detecting anything, and therefore you get the white label message itself. But if you reach to 2342388, you will realize that basically you're not getting a white label anymore. But what you are, what you have, is actually a, an output. Alright, so it tells you here, well done, you have found someone else's profile, and your profile is actually output right here. Alright, which is your uh, row three, color brown, size large, and you have the name Buffalo Bill, and your look at this uh, user over here. Alright, two, three, four, two, three, eight, eight. <coughs> Alright, so basically, you can actually see another person's profile, right? As long as you know the tab. Right, so we now know that yes, there is another way to get the profile through this particular, uh, through this particular URL.